and yep. mice that eat at the wrong time, which is in the daytime when they're supposed to be sleeping. But then we also had a group that were fed continuously. Caloric restriction is really the most effective intervention for extending lifespan in model organisms. Um, and when we looked at, at lifespan, the, 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 I think the biggest surprise was that that group of mice that had s uh, spread out feeding, uh, they they still lived longer. They lived 10% longer, but they did not live 30%. Yeah. And then the mice that ate at the wrong time, but they have a fasting interval of at least 12 hours, those mice live 20% longer. And then finally, the mice that eat at the right time, which is at night, they live 35% longer. So if the, if the caloric restriction is restricted to one window of time and it's constant from a circadian perspective at the same, same time every day, that's where you see the biggest effect. Yeah. And so, you know, and the only difference in, in this experiment is the pattern of food intake percent <laughs> difference in lifespan. Wow. Yeah. So that tells you this is a big effect.